Hollywood actor Zac Efron is clearly a man of many talents. Not only can he act and sing, he also knows how to work a pole. The Baywatch star appeared on The Graham Norton Show on Friday night alongside Tom Cruise and Annabelle Wallace to promote his latest movie. And it wasn't long before Graham asked the star to recreate an old topless magazine photo of himself using his core and upper body strength to balance horizontally as he holds onto a parking meter. Are you really doing that or otherwise? The presenter said with a smile. Not that I'm calling you a liar, but there is a pole right over there. No, he's doing it, Tom Cruise enthusiastically cut in. You want me to do it? A smart, suited and booted Zack then asked, has this thing been tested? But proving he's still got the skills and the strength, he pulled exactly the same move while holding onto the pole set up in the TV studio. I'm so happy I can still do that, he joked afterwards. Elsewhere in the show, Mission Impossible star Tom told how he grossed out when co-star Dustin Hoffman took his Rain Man phone booth scene a little too seriously. Hoffman's character passes wind in the scene in the Oscar-winning 1988 movie, in which he stars as Tom's autistic brother Raymond Babbitt. The actor said, We had spent two years developing the scene and when we were in the phone booth Hoffman leaned against the door and passed gas. It was real and that was the take. I was grossed out and said, how can you do that? It's disgusting. I tried to get out of the booth and everything I said to him was real. Speaking about his stunts in new film The Mummy, which involved creating a zero-gravity environment, Tom said, I had to convince the studio to let me do it and, we, had to do the scene 64 times. It took us two days and the crew was flying around and vomiting between takes. You couldn't train for this. Normally stunts take months of prepping but we just did it. The actor stars in The Mummy with Annabelle, who said of her steamy scenes on Peaky Blinders, I was in a sex scene and watching it with them, her parents, was so awkward. Afterwards, my dad said, well, we know where you get that from. Good girl.